Want it mystery. Uh, it takes it over once takes on Warrior. Takes it over once on Warrior. Top eight. Excuse me. Excuse you. And uh, doing a hand warmer. I don't know if they are. Oh, I thought. Oh, that's not a hand warmer. I believe. Wait, is it? Looked no, like it's a, not. Okay. Looks like a hand warmer. <laughs> it's Sinji setting up a trap to start the game. <laughs> See, he's even got the commentators. Deceptive. Deceived. Pardon. But um. If he, if he can get, that's something about Wario, uh, Wario that I don't really last forever. That should be it. Yeah, that's it. All right, Milk taking a shift in his seat, realizing that 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 was not if the trend can't continue. Essentially, no. he needs to change something about what was going on mm -hmm. before if he wants to stay competitive against Sinji here, because. Right now, this is looking brutally inside. And Pac-Man's ability to rack, to just put damage onto someone else is immense. Okay, I also feel like Sinji's gonna, he's having a lot of fun with the bike. If you notice right there, mm -hmm. he threw the bike up and then immediately upbeat. Yeah. Uh, Wario didn't quite get hit by it, but like you could see that he has like, he always has game plans. And like very clearly, I think he went into training mode with Wario's bike. To figure out like specific things he needs to he, do. He knows how to set things up really well, and that's what uh, separates the the boys from the men. And when it comes to playing Pac-Man at a level like this, Sinji is a man indeed. Just, just sniping Wario out of his bike with the fire hydrant. Some silly business. Really good job waiting on the ledge, and. That's something that I like seeing from Wario, uh, Wario players is uh, threatening people with that bite. But, oh, really good snipe. That great interception right there. Also, that looks like that's a full loft for yeah. uh, Milk. He is gassy indeed. Gassy and ready to burst there. And Wario has ways to combo into a neutral air. I feel like the... I maybe break into loft? I'm actually unsure of all of the confirms that... Wario now has at his disposal, but it I, seems I like he's fishing. I watch Mango stream too much, and he just throws it out. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, if he can get a good uh, combo setup, if he can, I know I think up till into waft or up air into waft uh, is a is a combo. But <gasps> oh, oh. I know neutral air can also lead into it. Potentially, yeah. Uh, he just needs to rack on some more damage. He definitely needs about 50 or 60 percent uh, with this amount of rage. If he if he loses his stock and tries to, to pull the trigger around nowish, it will not uh, not pan out well for him. And there it is. He still has the loft, but you know it's a lot less effective considering he doesn't have as much rage. But it can still kill right. extremely early, and maybe that's still his game plan right now. This close to the ledge, though, it, uh, if he was able to... I, f I almost feel like if he pulled it there, it could have killed, but just better safe than sorry is always the good uh, good option. I like seeing the bites uh, coming out from Warriors, as I was uh, saying before, but I think it's, it's like counter with sword characters. I don't think that it's something that Warrior players should... Um, rely on it should just be uh, a threatening presence that if they try to do aggressive options from ledge the bite will be there to to stop it so hopefully he, he utilizes that later on looks like he's just holding on to the waft now though maybe he wants to really save it for uh, last stock and rely more on safer kill options, maybe a I mean, high I, percent down I tilt to dash attack. One thing is that I feel like Shinji really changed the way his neutral yeah. had to be. You know, of course, he has to once Waft became live. And Milk is the type of player where it's not just the Waft that makes him so good, it's the fact that he knows the opponent is playing around him, mm -hmm. looking out for those specific kill setups, maybe putting themselves in a less overall favorable position because they're worried about it, kind of reluctant to overextend. And now the thing is, now that Sinji kind of realizes that uh, Milk can't just throw out the waft, he just goes in. That was, that was nutty, actually. I didn't, I didn't think that, that down air would be able to contest uh, Wario's up B. Is this hip hop? 
hitbox? Is that is the hitbox greater above him or beside him on that? Um, it's like, yeah, maybe it was reaching the end of the. I still can't believe that guy kills. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's pretty high percent at the edge of the stage, but still, it is kind of, kind of nutty. Not too sure what Milk will be able to do here to uh, change things up, but... Okay, you know, though. I mean, one thing you could do is land walks. It's true. <laughs> I mean, like, it's much easier said than done. <laughs> I do think that the beginning of that game was just so effective for Sinji. And after that, they were playing relatively neck and neck even. So that means that if Milk doesn't get the game run like if he doesn't let the game run away from him if he always has to at the very least the, the potential the threat of making the comeback then Sinji will have to change the way he plays and perhaps that can be what he needs uh in order for milk to take game two but like what he, what he was doing just a second ago is what i was highlighting uh before the game uh was starting is that he needs to be able to just get in and break the bar like just break the barrier between them because if Wario there is, the, you do need to respect Galaga which um, Sinji is using a very Galaxia hmm? Galaxia 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 it's well, not Galaga apparently I'm just gonna keep calling it Galaga it's too too ingrained in, in the muscle memory. the Galaga <laughs> the Galaga <laughs> but um, if if he just sits back and let Sinji throw out these uh, ships, then it's gonna it's gonna re do, uh Yeah, but let's really yeah, look at this game game. state. Milk has done a fantastic job of maintaining and just putting on this big lead, and Sinji will be getting a bit hungry, throwing out an uncharacteristic pressurized forward smash. I don't know if Milk has been dropping shield that much, but in that instance, he did not fight it at all. And that means that now he's at 80% while Sinji is almost about to hit 150. Waft is also currently uh, online. I feel like the forward smashes, though, um, from, from Sinji, they're not necessarily uncharacteristic, but they just might seem a little weird to other players. At that percent, at, at that, that positioning, percent. when he was like higher percent at like 80, that. At 80, maybe. Okay, yeah, actually, now that I realize he was at pretty low percent, but... And also Sinji was at higher percent. Mm -hmm. Usually, I mean, Sinji will go for them, like... Right. Like, he will. It's not completely uncharacteristic, but like... Oh, that's actually really big for Sinji. The fact that now yeah, he doesn't to get the fart. Because, like, if he managed to get that waft, it would have been basically a wrap. Like, that would have been, like, a secure, though, win right. situation. So Coming at the very out least. with the bite. Yeah, uh, see, that's what I want him to do. He's, Sinji keeps trying to go for these aggressive options. If he did it again, then maybe he would have gotten it. And, <laughs> like, was zooming. I don't even know how that happened, but it did, and now Something Milk is happened. dead. Fire Hydrant hit Milk, and he died. <laughs> But you can see on his face, he's uh okay. We're just gonna, we're just gonna play it out. And actually, he has no waft. And granted, he, I don't think he's landed a single waft yet. No. But um, he's probably gonna have a, one more of those before the game is actually finished because we are at 3:40. Yes, and it's on after what, like a two minutes almost. Uh, I believe we do seven minute games, so it's been about three and a half minutes, right? Yeah. So. Uh, technically, this is halfway point, and mm. this game could go to time if it really needed to. I mean, we're at we're at the halfway mark, and we're at two stocks, both. So, but Whether the pace has been increased a lot. It's right. Also, to take into account how much um, Wario's been eating things, he definitely play into the waft. That is true. Every time he eats something, uh, he does actually. Uh, the timer decreases takes down, yeah. just a little bit. Well, that could be big. No, not yet. Yeah, it doesn't go for stage, an up smash. stage pressure. Stage presence, yes, but uh, uh, up smash was 
It was too high to hit it. Safely. Yeah, since he just knows the hitbox character so well. If he does not go for an option you think that he should have gone for, okay. it's probably because he knows better than you and he shouldn't have gone for Waft it. is now online. How he uses it will be not there, but for future reference, how he uses it will be very interesting ah. to see. Yeah, without rage, uh, maybe this move is going to be killing around like 40% fully charged waft. I would say 50 or 60. Maybe not 40, depending on where you are. That's but, true, yeah. Um, if, it, if it's like here, center stage, definitely not. At the edge, yes, definitely. But um, it all depends on positioning. Oh, if the ship didn't hit him on the way back. All right. This is... I'm actually surprised at how much damage Pac-Man just racks up because it, like, it looks as if... Milk is just going crazy on him, and whenever he gets these uh, these little strings, but it's just not doing much damage. I always forget that back air and uh, up air are the main damage dealers in his um, aerial arsenal. He needs to do something with this Galaxia. Seems like Milk is just holding on to it to keep Sinji from having it. Yeah. Oh, that's and as awesome. soon as he throws it, actually, it gets turned around on oh. and that's going to be it. Yeah, there it is. The Val into forward smash. Sinji Good takes game. the set 2-0, guaranteeing himself top 8, where he is now going to be facing against King Arc in winner's semis. Oh, that's going to that's gonna be a fun one. Yeah. Probably going to go to time, but <laughs> that's going to be a fun not one. Not with King Arc. Nah, probably not. He plays a very aggressive back, man. Oh, yeah. Uh, 